Hi everyone, I'm Akila. In this video, let us see how to filter the data in transform query mode after loading the data from the data sources. My requirement is to filter the fact internet sales table based on the order date column. I want only 2010 year data for this report. So before I apply filters, let me count the total number of rows in this table. So I have come up with a measure with count rows function and I'm passing the fact internet sales table name. It has given there are 60. K. That's how I came to know there are 60,000 rows before I apply filters. Now let me go to transform query mode. And let me select this fact internet sales table and go straight to the order date because the requirement is clear, right? They want the filter on order date. As a complete report is based on this order date for only 2010 year, it is irrelevant to load all the data and apply filters in your visualization, right? We can get rid of all other rows as part of our data cleaning. That's why I'm filtering the data here. So go to your order date and the maximum limit is only 1000 so to see the sample data so here we have date and time filters i am selecting between because 2010 is not current or previous right so i can't go with that okay anyway the requirement is a specific for only 2010 january to december right so let me select a date and update this to 2010 from january 1st to 2 December 31st okay. is after or equal to means after 20 January before means before December click OK. See for each and every step that it will be applied here updated here under applied steps. So my data has been filtered and giving only 2010 rows. Close and apply as I am interested to show you the filters in Power Query mode. I have done this. Apply changes. See? There are only 14 rows enough.